So we know a lot of times people wonder why we show certain things to kids, and in this case we have covered this music genre for years now with every age group except kids beyond a Kids React episode all the way back in 2012. Is it K-pop? The genre is called K-pop. Yes! K-pop. I love K-pop. I love K-pop so much. It's like a genre of music with like different genres of music inside of it. So all the artists today we have covered before with other generations, but for the first time we get to get a kid's perspective and we're sure we'll cover them again with other people down the line. Okay. So we're going to start with a girl group called Twice. Oh my gosh, I love Twice. Oh my gosh, they are literally amazing. I have to breathe, I have to breathe. Oh my gosh. I'm so happy. Let me count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine girls. They look pretty. That's a band? Pretty big band. Twice means a double. It's nine, but like if they had eight, then I would understand why twice would be the name because four times two equals eight. For K-pop, that's like a pretty average number, I would say, because there's like big groups, there's like NCT, there's 17, like, hmm, it can really vary, so nine, it's not that bad. Whoa. Mm. What the heck? I like it, especially chocolate ice cream. I noticed that K-pop videos have so many colors in them. And it's like a big festival all the time. Oh my gosh, this song is such a bop. Like literally, I heard it and I was like. The beat. They're good at dancing, it's just I don't really get the song. language, so I have to read. Oh my gosh. What? These are like the songs you would find in an arcade, and then you do the dance thing where you have to put your foot on the different pads. You think it's gonna be completely different from what they usually do, but it still has like elements of twice. Bang, bang. Love the outfits though. Paper clips. Wow. I liked it. I liked that one a lot. That might be my favorite song. So There's people who like speak her... their language get their language, like, can understand them, and people who speak English can understand that. I love their outfits. It just, they all look amazing. There's, like, nothing I don't like about it. It's just really good. It's so good. It's literally such a bop on repeat. On repeat all day. The band Got7 is up next with their single, Eclipse. Wait. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I think it's called Got Seven because there's seven people. I've heard of Got Seven, but I haven't really listened to a lot of their music really. There's Jackson, there's Bam Bam, and that's all I know. Why they sad? <laughs> All the, it seems like K-pop bands have the best music video effects. I like this song better than the first song. Ready? The beat is about to drop. I think I could have understand the girl band more well than this one. Maybe 
their dancers are just so cool. Why don't they do this? He just covered his face like this. Why are they covering their eyes? Is there like something we're not supposed to see? Okay, I like this one a lot better than the first one. I feel like the first one, the when the girls dance, I feel like they dance a little better, but the I feel like the boys sing better. I like the whimsicalness and the like. And they're like, Shazam, with glass. And they probably paid it a lot of money for it. It's so different from, like, things that we have in, like, America. Like, you wouldn't see that in a music video. The choreography with the music videos, it really makes you think, like, why do we not step it up? Up next is the group Monsta X. I've heard of this group. Isn't that, like, the thing that they mentioned in We Bear Bears? I didn't know they were actually real. <laughs> I have no clue from this picture why they call it Monster X. They don't look like monsters at all. It looks scary. Why are they saying all oh, 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 here? Alligator. Alligator. Wait, were those a blue man? Nice. Pretty cool, actually. Why have I not listened to this before? I'm not very smart. This song is probably the weirdest out of all of them. Not bad. I wish it dropped like harder, like a big difference, but like I'm not mad at it. Oh my gosh. You're right, this is a banger, my gosh. Oh my gosh, I'm like, so much stuff happening at once and I'm like, this is amazing. What's the visuals, the choreography, it's too much at once. There's a lot of K-pop idols that are trying to like break into the US and so I think that before K-pop was like just like a Korean thing, like it's like their thing. But now I feel like K-pop has really um, come into the West. That was like more of like a upbeat one. Like, yeah, I like that one. Cause it was like, oh, 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 It was good, but it was really weird how they just started doing, just bumping their heads. It got too creepy. And now we have the girl group, Black Pink. Yes! Oh my God, my God, my God. Yes, Rosé. Jinsu, get it, girl. Hey, look at Rosé. Do you see her outfit? Girl. They all are like in flashy clothing. Before they came out, there was like kind of like a shortage on like girl crush concepts, I would say. Those that were doing it, they weren't really big. So for like YG to like come out with them, like, oh my gosh, such a banger. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jenny killing us every day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Black pink in your area. Black Pink really sets the mood. This group honestly has the best, uh, like, uh, uh, music. That's cereal? Like, what is that? But it's gorgeous. 
I don't, is that coral reef on her fed? But I don't care. I like this song. I just wish they would release a full album for one. This song is different from all the other ones for sure. Sounds like they're in a really hard relationship. I'm gonna do it, ready? It's really unexpected. Let's kill this love! Dude, their dancing is like perfectly synchronized and all. Their English sounds pretty good. Oh, they have the soldiers. Kill this love, it's sad but true. You gotta kill this love before it kills you too. These people like to say the word kill. Oh my gosh. Holy shiitake mushrooms. I can't. I can't do it. I can't do this. I'm a total blank. Why do they want to destroy this love, though? Probably because their true love left them, and now they're back to destroy. This one had a coherent, more coherent lyrics. I'd probably listen to that. They're dedicated, and you need talent, cooperation, and dedication just to get this far and it really pays off for them. So as we mentioned, we haven't covered K-pop on Kids React since early 2012, and we wanted to see what opinions may have changed since then. So how old were you again in 2012? Probably never even born. I wasn't even alive. No, actually, no, I was one. I was like four years old and probably <clears throat> in like, uh, like kindergarten or something. 2012, I was five. I didn't even know what K-pop was back in 2012. Like, legit, no joke. I didn't even know what Blackpink was like six months ago. I'm so sad that I didn't get into K-pop sooner. Like, I had heard of it for so long, and I was like, oh, I'm fine, I'm good. And then I just like fell down the hole. So back on the first Kids React to K-pop episode, not a single kid in that episode had heard of K-pop. Do you think that that's changed? Do you or your friends know about K-pop? Well, um, I don't know. They never talk about it. None of my friends know, but all my cousins do. I've actually never heard any K-pop until today. That's probably the most thing we talk about is K-pop. Back then, K-pop had it was heard of here in America, but it wasn't definitely as big as it is now. Well, if you were to take a guess, what or who do you think are the two fastest videos on YouTube to ever hit 100 million views? Um, probably like, um, maybe sports or something. Is it K-pop? I would probably think it's FB or K-pop. K-pop. Probably Blackpink's Kill the Slub, because not even, I don't even think it was a day it reached 100 million views. And I also think it was Taylor Swift's Me. I know that it is definitely Boy With Love is number one. Number two is Kill the Slub, because I streamed that stuff. Well, currently the K-pop group BTS and Blackpink hold the top records for fastest videos to hit 100 million views. What? How? How? Well, because probably all of the, all of the, they're known all over the world and all, and that really pays off. I remember um, Ariana Grande with Thank You Next got up there, and then Blackpink was like, hey sis, um, bye. So when you compare our kids react to K-pop in 2012 when no kids knew about K-pop to now with the massive success they're having online and on tour and on the music charts, from your perspective, why is K-pop becoming so popular all over the world? Because their music is great and their dancing is, Great. Now you even see people in the in the YouTube comments. The most popular band I think out there is BTS. 
<clears throat> because every time I, I'm like just looking at comments on videos, somebody has like a BTS picture and everybody's commenting, ARMY! Their music is just so good. Like it reaches out to the audience. Choreography, like you can learn it. It makes you feel like um, you're more connected with the artist. And then like with things like having a bias and then thinking about like standing different groups and then uh, like comebacks and then buying the album and like people like showing their photo card like it really makes you more invested in it to like keep going like throughout the years thanks for watching this episode of kids react shout out to kaya brown subscribe and hit the bell so you never miss an episode thanks for watching bye hey it's sierra producer here at fbe make sure you go follow us on instagram at fbe to get a behind the scenes look at all things fbe go drop a comment and i'll see you guys there bye guys